This last we were put on problem using neutral collapsing method. This is a two bus system. Bus one is a slack bus. Voltage is 190. Bus two is a load bus. The load is 150 megawatts plus J50 megavolt ampere reactive. Base MBA is equal to 100. Line series impedance is 0 0.12 plus J 0.16 per unit. The question is calculate V2 and delta 2 using Newton Raphson method. Perform one iteration only. First step we have to form a Y bus matrix. This is the Y bus matrix of the system 3 minus J4. This is in a rectangular form. In polar form, 5 angle minus 53.13. This is 5 angle 126.87. This is 5 angle 126.87. This is 5 angle minus 53.13 degrees. Next, I assume delta 2 is equal to 0. V2 is equal to 1. Second step, I have to calculate P2 and Q2. We know the formula. Here J is a running variable. I is a fixed variable. I is equal to 2. J is equal to 1 comma 2. Now I expand the equation. I substitute all the values. Calculated P2 value is 0. Similarly, we know the general formula of QI. Here I is equal to 2. J is equal to 1 comma 2. Expand the equation. Substitute all the values. Calculated Q2 value is 0. Step 3, I have to calculate the specified value of P2 and the specified value of Q2. P2 specified is equal to PG2 minus PD2. Since it is a load bus, the generation is 0. Therefore, 0 minus 150 by 100. This is base MBA. That is equal to minus 1.5 per unit. Similarly, Q2 specified is equal to Q2 generation minus Q2 demand. 0 minus 50 by 100 minus 0 0.5 per unit. I can calculate del P2 that is P2 specified minus P2 calculated. P2 specified is minus 1.5. This is P2 calculated is 0. Therefore del P2 is equal to minus 1.5 per unit. Similarly del Q2 is equal to Q2 specified minus 0.5 Q2 calculated is 0 del Q2 is equal to minus 0.5 per unit fourth step I have to find the elements of Jacobian matrix I did a mistake QA is equal to minus this is minus sign therefore QA is equal to this is minus sign this is minus sign not a plus sign the answer Q2 calculated is 0 next we have to calculate dou P2 by dou del 2 Dou P2 by dou del 2 is equal to 4. Dou P2 by dou modulus of B2 that is equal to 3. Dou Q2 by dou del 2 that is equal to minus 3. Dou Q2 by dou modulus of B2 that is equal to 4. So this is the Jacobian matrix. Step 5. I rewrite the matrix like this. Next I have to find the inverse of this matrix. This is the inverse of this matrix. Now I can easily calculate del del 2 and del modulus of V2. So the delta 2 value is minus 0.18 radians. The change in modulus of V2 value is minus 0.26. The new value is the old value is 0 and 1. Now delta 2 new is equal to delta 2 old. Old is 0. The Calculated value is minus 0.18. This is in radians into 180 by pi. That is equal to minus 10.31 degrees. That is delta to nu. Similarly, del modulus of V to nu is equal to old value. Old value is 1. Del modulus of V2, the calculated value is minus 0.26. This value is 0 0.74 per unit. Therefore, V1 is equal to 190. V2 is equal to 0.74 angle minus 10.31 degrees. The first iteration of the neutral option method. In the second of our iteration, we have to use this value and proceed up to the convergence. This way we have to work out this problem. Thanks for listening.